Hello, 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 how you doing? Good evening, good afternoon. It's a great day today. It's hot. It is so hot. So you would think that after going to jail on some serious charges, and you would think after being lucky enough to make bond, that anyone with any common sense would sit down. You wouldn't drive while intoxicated. You would sit down and you would mind your business and you would stay in your lane and you would do everything possible so that you can't get in any trouble anymore. That's what you would think. That's what I would do. But you know, some people just don't understand and some people just don't get it when you're out on bond. So basically, talking about Quando Rondo has done went and done some stupid stuff. So he was <laughs> driving at a high rate of speed, crashed his car, and emergency responders had to administrate Narcan because he was ex spirit exhibiting signs of an overdose. So, anyone that is out on bond, you know you can't drink, or you know you can't do any drugs, or at least get caught. This dude has to have Narcan, so the prosecutor has asked for his bond to be revoked. What else did you think was fixing to happen? Chapman County Superior Court says... <laughs> Rondo crashed a car while driving at a high speed Wednesday and that the emergency responders sponsors administrated Narcan because he was exhibiting the signs, like I said, of an overdose. And there is a hearing in the next couple of days. So dude is probably more than likely the judge is going to revoke his bond when all he had to do was sit down. I don't understand some people's actions at times. I really don't. I'm going to watch this just because I want to see what happens to this dude. I wish him the best, but you can't, you can't, you just can't do things like that when you're on bond. I mean, come on.